Welcome to Scythe. Today we'll be providing an overview of using Scythe mode with M.52. Scythe mode is a valuable tool that allows you to get the most out of your M.52. Today we'll be talking about some terms and concepts that will help you use the Scythe mode and the autonomous features of your machine safely and efficiently. While M.52 has many features that will quickly make it feel like another member of the crew, it is important to remember that it is a tool designed for specific tasks and you, the operator, are in charge of how and where it does those tasks and that it does them safely. For example, you will have to set the areas that M.52 mows inside. You will have to set the areas the machine does not go inside. And you will need to keep people and pets away from M.52 when it is in scythe mode, just as you do with any other mower you use. You will have to keep the blades sharp, the tires at the correct pressure, the cameras clean, and other things that will ensure you get the best performance from M.52. To use scythe mode, you'll need to create mow zones. Mow zones are areas that you want the machine to mow. You'll also need to create no-go zones for the areas that you do not want the M.52 to mow, because you are in charge of where the machine does and does not go. You'll need to be sure to create a no-go zone for every object or area that the machine should go around or avoid. Once you've created mow zones and no-go zones for your M.52, you can give it a task. A task is the machine mowing within a mow zone and avoiding the no-go zones using the settings that you, the operator, have chosen. These settings can be things like mowing pattern, such as stripe or spiral, the height of cut, the blade speed, and the ground speed. While it is performing a task, M.52 uses its perception system, including the eight cameras, to see the world around it. This machine will take certain actions based on what it sees, including certain obstacles. These actions are not intended to be a substitute for the watchful eye of you, the operator. It is your responsibility to ensure you stop operation of M.52 if people or pets are nearby and to keep the Mozone clear of any obstacles or hazards. Mozones, no-go zones, and tasks are all data that your M.52 stores and is available to be used again on your M.52. That same data is available to all of the M.52 within your fleet within a few minutes of being created. That data is viewable and manageable within your Scythe mobile app and within your fleet web application. You can further organize according to the property that the Mo zones are at. You now have a basic understanding of the autonomous concepts that M.52 uses during Scythe mode. Let's go get Mo done.